girls, I know this is all very, very exciting. So I have asked you all here today for a very important and wonderful announcement. This news is so, so exciting that Mrs. Kathy Mears, who is the superintendent of all the Catholic schools in the Archdiocese of Boston, is here. Also, boys and girls, Mrs. Sullivan is back. volunteered to be my Goodwill Ambassador this year, and Ava is going to present Mrs. Mears and Mrs. Sullivan with a token from this momentous occasion. It's one of our blue bracelets. Let us begin as we begin everything. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Dear Lord and Father of all, thank you for today. Thank you for the way which you provide for each one of us and for your protection and love. Help us to focus our hearts and minds now on what we are about to hear at this assembly. We ask this in the name of Jesus, and everybody, amen. When Sister Irene joined us three years ago, she kept talking about this big award that was given to schools, not in the city, not in the state, but in the country. And she was insistent that I look at this information and that we apply. Sister said, we are a perfect fit for this award. So I looked it up. National Blue Ribbon Schools Award. And this is what I found. A vision of the excellence and hold everyone to high standards, which translates to work hard and always do our best. Mutual respect and trust that runs deep, which means living our mission statement that we say every morning. Dedicated faculty and staff that are supported and respected. This is obvious. We love our teachers and staff, and we know how hard they all work. Families, faculty, staff that work together with cooperation and trust. You know that best when your parents come home from a parent-teacher conference and they have all kinds of ideas for how, to, for how to improve. And then lastly, the National Department of Education in Washington, D.C. honors high-performing schools by standards of excellence evidenced by student achievement, which simply means we do our very best, especially on our standardized testing. Does this sound like Mount Alvernia Academy? Yes, it does. From preschool through sixth grade. Boys and girls, Sister Irene was right. So we applied. Seems simple? No. The approximate number of schools that can be nominated and invited to apply are 417. This year, it was 331. Only 50 are private schools. Now remember, you, boys and girls, our students, have to work really hard and score well on tests. As a matter of fact, our school had to rank in the top 15% of the country. Then you get to apply. You apply to the Council for American Private Education. A panel reviews your application and then you are nominated. You are notified of the results and then you receive feedback on how to improve on your application. I am delighted to share that we received our application back, no improvements needed. That was an A plus for our committee. Now you ask, who's the committee? We have Mr. Darling, Sister Irene Lawrence, Mrs. McCafferty, Mrs. Maddox, Mrs. McKaylee, Mrs. Walsh, and lastly, me. So we submitted the final application to the United States Department of Education. 
Boys and girls, I kid you not, it took hours, day after day, to get this application right. We brainstormed, we wrote, we rewrote, we edited, we used a dictionary, we used a thesaurus, and every grammar book in Mrs. McCafferty's collection. So you know how much work went into this. Well, guess what? That work paid off. Faculty and staff, boys and girls, Mount Alvernier Academy has been awarded and named a 2015 Blue Ribbon School, and I am so proud of you. Boys and girls, we're going to... took time out of her very busy day to come and celebrate because she's as very proud of you as I am. I am so excited to be here. Do you understand that you're one of 50 non-public schools in the whole country? You're one of the very best in the whole country. One of the very best in the whole country. You are the only school in Massachusetts, private school in Massachusetts. So I think you need to turn and thank your teachers who have worked so hard, and your principal and your parents. So I want to hear how loud you can cheer for all your teachers and principal and parents. of him and the entire archdiocese, congratulations. What you don't know is that last year I judged Blue Ribbon Schools, so I know how hard it is, and I know all the people who didn't work as hard on their application who didn't get the Blue Ribbon. So you need to really thank that your committee and all who work so hard, and thank yourselves because your good work helps too. So congratulations, Mount Alberti. Keep up the great work. stand here before you today. Boys and girls, can we have a round of applause for our faculty and staff? Boys and girls, can you please stand in your places so you, the faculty and staff may give you a round of applause? I would like for you to recite our mission statement. Our mission statement is at the core of everything we think, do, and say at Mount Alvernier Academy. Are we ready? God made me. done, boys and girls. Please remain standing, and at this time, I'd like to invite the Blue Ribbon Committee forward to offer a prayer of thanksgiving. And as we begin everything, again, we say in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. As we celebrate becoming a Blue Ribbon School, let us once again thank God for the wonderful honor as we begin all prayer by saying amen. Please respond to each prayer with thank you God. God our Father and creator of all good things in our world and within the Mount Alvernia Academy school community, we thank you for the gift of this day. Thank you God. God, our Father and Creator of all good things, we thank you for the wonderful honor of being named a Blue Ribbon School. Thank you, God. 
God, our Father and creator of all good things, we thank you for our principal, vice principal, teachers, and staff who guide us as we grow spiritually and academically each day. God, our Father and Creator of all good things, we thank you for our parents who make many sacrifices so that you, their children, may be a part of the Mount Alvernia Academy family. Thank, thank you, God. And we pray as we end our day as a school community, we not only thank you for your goodness to us, dear God, but we also ask you for your continued guidance and for the courage to live our Mount Alvernia mission statement each day, to walk in the footsteps of Jesus, St. Francis, and St. Clair. And boys and girls, our response to that is going to be the song, Peace is Flowing Like a River. So please be prepared to sing. enough of how proud I am of all of you each and every single day. Even, even when it comes to the, the redos and the do-overs and the pre-tests and the homework, it's all worth it. Boys and girls, this is a celebration for you, for your parents, for the faculty and staff. I'm so, so very proud of you.